This video tutorial is about scene panel and manipulating with object layers in scene panel. The scene panel shows a list of the content in the current scene and is where you can manage selections to edit objects. About search for objects. Use the search field to find objects by name. Results include partial matches. To see all objects again, delete any search terms. About filter objects. Use the filter to find assets by type, model, light, camera. Any unselected objects will be hidden. To see all objects again, clear all filters. For now physical lights are not available for Adobe Dimension as for Adobe Substance 3D Stager. Therefore lights are available for selecting and editing in property panel when environment is selected in scene. About select objects. One of the primary functions of the scene panel is to manage the selection state. The selection status is synced between the viewport and scene panel. About single selection. Click on an object to select it. About multi-selection. Hold Command, Mac, or Control, Windows, and select an object to add and remove an object to the current selection. About Range Selection Hold Shift while selecting to select a range of objects. About Auto Scroll and Auto Expand The scene panel will try to ensure objects selected are visible by scrolling and expanding hierarchies automatically. Automatically expanded hierarchies will also automatically collapse when the selection is changed. Manually expanding a hierarchy will not auto-collapse. About change object state. The scene panel provides access to common state management for objects. Some state shortcuts are shared across object types, while others are unique to specific object types. About lock. Toggles whether the object is locked or unlocked. Locked objects cannot be edited. About visibility. Toggles whether the object is visible in both preview and final renders. Holding Alt plus clicking on the visibility icon of an object will toggle the visibility of all other 3D objects, does not affect cameras or lights, as a quick way to isolate a single object. You can also quickly hide and lock streak of object by mouse move on eye or lock icon. You can also rename objects by double clicking on object layer in the scene. Adding new objects. New objects are always added at the root of the scene hierarchy and last in the scene list order. Creating a new object will always select the newly created object. Adding or duplicating an object with a name that matches one already in your scene will append a number to the new object. Example, first object, lamp wireframe, second object, lamp wireframe 2. A divider will show when the object will be placed between other objects. There are distinct snap points for dragging within a hierarchy to make parent-slash-child relationships.